Welcome back to American Ground Radio. I'm Stephen Paul with Lewis R. Avalone. We are a nation of laws, not of men. Yep. If you fail to enforce the laws, mm-hmm. then aren't you incentivizing that behavior? There are no consequences. If you don't enforce your laws, you have no laws. If you don't enforce your standards, you have no standards. If you tell your kid bedtime is 8.30 and you let them stay up till 11 o'clock, guess what time bedtime is? It ain't 830. Well, we talked about it last week. You know, of course, we just celebrated Father's Day. Last month, we celebrated Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. And we were talking about those life lessons that at the time that our parents, you know, may have scolded us, may have reprimanded us, may have punished us. And we didn't understand it at the time. Sure. I've I've heard about such things. I I never had to go through it. But later on in life, (laughs) you were grateful that there were consequences for your behavior. That's true. It's true. Now NBC News is reporting, speaking of no consequences, however. Uh, Brian Williams? uh, (laughs) Well, that's another story altogether. I see, sorry. NBC News is now reporting out of 485 looting arrests in New York City Mm -hmm. during the riots, Mm -hmm. a whopping 222 have had all the charges dropped against them man portland's got them beat the portland da is uh, has dropped more than 400 charges for rioting and looting in that city and the ones that they did convict in new york city uh uh-huh. they were convicted on a much lesser charge right. of trespassing which means no jail time i mean so wait, basically, wait 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 you get to burn a cvs yes and you get trespassing you can smash storefronts in the bronx and men in the manhattan boroughs the of problem New York wasn't city. that they were in the cvs the problem wasn't that they were in the stores the problem was that they were looting the stores lighting them on fire i understand but if democrats sympathize with your political cause then that looting is legal, or at least it's decriminalized. This is why I say the Democrats are immoral, because they don't believe that they are Machiavellian. You can do the wrong thing as long as you're doing it for the right reasons, and Democrats are okay with that. That's absolutely wrong. You must do the right thing for the right reason in the right way, or you are wrong. Speaking of no consequences, Mm -hmm. Minneapolis, Democrat-run Minneapolis, Mm -hmm. gunshot victims up 90%. Over the last year, 90%. Mm-hmm. How's that defunding the police working for you? I- exactly. And you know what they, of course, the uh, Star Tribune mm-hmm. there in Minneapolis, you know, it's, of course, it's a left leaning sure. newspaper. Yeah. Do you know who they blame? You know who they blame, or do you know what they blame? Donald Trump. The increase of 90%, 90% of gunshot victims up over the past year. They blame the pandemic. The pandemic. That's insane. Not gun sales. That's insane. That's nuts. But but the pandemic. 